Three. Lindsey Huddleston back in the building. I'm with the winning coach, Coach Todd Negotian, uh, representing for the North Farmington Raiders and also for the holiday extravaganza 2021. And it was a great, great event. Three days of outstanding basketball. Coach, you wore so many hats today. Also wearing the hat as a winning coach of the last game. Tell me how this last three days was for you. Uh, it feels good to end it on a win, that's for sure. Definitely. It, uh, you know, it's good. It's an event that we've decided to do, you know, basically six years ago. We didn't do it last year because of COVID. And uh, we just wanted to try and bring in some of the local better teams, better kids, and put them on a pretty good stage and uh, do it the right way. Um, so I felt like, you know, it's grown each year. We're trying to do it the right way. And uh, at the end of the day, it's all about kids and making sure they're put on a stage that they can excel in. And I think we've been able to do that. Absolutely. You know, um, it was pretty seamless from my experience being down here, but I can only imagine there are so many other things that go into it. How do you make a great event come off really well and still be able to keep your focus as a coach? I got a great staff. You know, it's uh, I got Pete Mantilla as my assistant coach, who's been a head coach for 17 years. Uh, my dad, who's been here for 25, Jerry Young, Craig Blackwell. Those guys do a lot of it for me um, behind the scenes and make sure they ran a lot of practices the last couple of days, shoot rounds and stuff, so I can make sure we did everything and got the facility ready to go each day. But it, uh, at the end of the day, it's making sure I'm ready to coach our guys because I know what they put into it. So I need to make sure I can match their intensity and make sure I'm ready to be there for them. Yeah, you definitely did that. A few more things. Um, scheduling Williamson, scheduling Loyola. Talk about those two different teams and what it took and what you got out of matching up with those teams. Well, they're both two different teams. Um, you know, they both like to shoot it, but Williamson's big. You know, they got three Division One kids that can really play the play well. They're well coached. Um, they're like a lot of teams in our league. Um, Loyola's kind of a different team. The ones can get up and down. Um, they're like some teams in our league, but that's more so what we're going to see in the state tournament, we feel like. So it, uh, our whole program's based upon making sure we're good in March. Um, even our young kids, our JV and our freshmen, we want to build and make sure we're playing well at the end of the year and they've learned our system. And then our varsity, we just want to use the first 20 games you know we want to win every one we want to win a division championship like always but we want to make sure we're really good in March when that comes around and uh, so we use every non-league game we kind of build to it yeah what is it like coaching Ryan Hurst a player of the game 39 points tonight what is that like it's fun um, you know he has such a high IQ for the game and he loves the game um, he's made a seamless transition into our program for us with uh, being unselfish trying to make sure he fit in to us instead of us fitting into him and uh, it's just been it's been a pleasure he is always asking questions always trying to get help always trying to be around our guys um, and it's just been it's been an absolute joy so far and I can't see it changing anytime soon that's great you did shout out your coaches or anyone else you want to shout out before we let you go no it's just been a great transition for us this year with the holiday extravaganza Wallace Whitfield does all our officials. He helps me run it. Um, but from everybody on down, it's uh, Carol Wiggle who does our concession stand to all the people who volunteered. It's just been an unbelievable three days for us. Um, great crowds, great you know fans, great referees. Everything was great. Um, having you guys here to make sure you broadcast it for the kids. And at the end of the day, that's what it's about, making sure kids can get out there, kids can get seen, and uh, getting them on social media platforms and doing everything we can to help kids achieve their goals. Yeah, it was a definitely a great event. I'm glad to be a part of it. Lindsey Housen with SBS here with Todd Negotian wrapping up at North Farmington. We'll see you guys next time.